Hey guys, it's Jeff. I promise you, at least once or twice a day, I get an email or a question or a tweet or a comment asking me about the apps that I use on my iPhone, whether it's Jailbreak or App Store, it doesn't matter. People wanna know what I'm using. So I'm gonna share with you in this video a high level overview of the apps that I'm currently using. And I'll do this from time to time just to give you a glimpse into the intimate details of my iPhone. Let's see, I use LastPass which is an App Store app, it's great. Um, I think LastPass costs about, what, 10 bucks a year? Basically allows you to store all your passwords securely and then allows you to log in to various websites without having to you know, put in the password every time. And it allows you to have a different password for every website, which keeps, keeps you pretty secure. The next thing I have is Screens. Screens is actually recommended to me by Alex, who writes for uh, iPhone Download Blog. And I highly recommend this. It's nice because it allows you to connect to your Mac, um, you know, over 3G even. So I can be anywhere in the world and I can connect to my desktop and, you know, do things on my desktop. It uses multi-touch. It's just really, it's really Mac oriented. You can tell it was designed with a Mac in mind. So that's awesome if you have a Mac. If not, there's other options like Log Me In, Team Viewer, things like that, which work just, you know, pretty well as, as well. Echo Phone is, Currently sharing duties with uh, Tweetbot right now for my Twitter app of choice. I'm still kind of leaning on the fence whether or not I want to get rid of Echo Phone. I don't think so. Uh, Reader. Now, this isn't just because it's popular amongst bloggers. I actually use this on a daily basis. Actually, it's one of the first things I do when I get up. Open up Reader, see what's happening in the news. Did I miss anything? Am I on top of things? Um, and that gets me up to speed really fast. Um, so Reader is a must-have. I mean, it's awesome. OmniFocus is like a task management, getting things done sort of app. It's actually one of our App Store apps of the week, I think a few weeks ago. Uh, highly recommend it. It is pricey. I'm not going to even, you know, try to front on that one. It's It costs a lot. So unless you're serious about getting things done, you might want to hold off on that for something a little cheaper. Analytics Pro, it's great. It allows you to you know, run Google Analytics. It's the best Google Analytics app on the App Store by far, no questions asked. Next I have, let's see, of course, Tweetbot, I already talked about that. It's, you know, it's great, it's awesome. The best UI for any Twitter app ever, but lacks a few features. Um, Verbs, it's a good um, Google, uh, Google Talk app, allows you to, you know, chat with your friends, things like that. Uh, Plex, that's a biggie. Plex is five bucks on the uh, App Store. It allows you to stream movies from your Mac um, via Wi-Fi or 3G. So another awesome tool. That's pretty much it. Games, not really doing too much there. I have, um, of course, Cut the Robe, Angry Birds, Peggle, Tetris, just your, just your average games. That's pretty much it. I mean, that's what I really use. As far as tweaks and things are concerned, let me just hop over there. Uh, clean status. I use clean status on a regular. It allows my uh, status bar to be clean up there, as you can see. I use icon renamer, photo enhancer, um, SB settings. But I did just reinstall my iPhone. I did just restore it to stock, so I just reinstalled everything. I do use quite a few more jailbreak tweaks, but I haven't got them. I haven't reinstalled them all yet. Kind of just waiting. So that's pretty much what's running on my iPhone. Um, hope that answered a lot of questions about what I use, why I use them, um, and let me know if you have any suggestions, really, or if there's any app that you see here that you want to know more about, just let me know. Maybe I can give you some more information. Also, if there's anything you recommend, let me know as well, because I'm always looking for, you know, good apps. I don't, I'm kind of picky when it comes to apps, but when I find one I really like, I tend to stick with it for the long haul. So let me know what you guys think. This is Jeff with jailbreakmovies.com.